And there is the first points of the match. It's going to be finished off by Danielle Cormier as she gets the X-Women on the board here in the ninth. That's exactly what we're talking about, Ryan. Danielle Cormier, much smaller body, but she, as she picks the ball out of the back of the rack, she keeps her body low, her shoulders and her hips driving straight up the ball. Pushing for the goal uh, line. And looks like it is in. And it's going to be Gray who comes away with the try to even this one up in the 18th minute. And there it is, getting in now. As that's going to be Sam Lake who finishes it off for the X-Women as they retake the lead here with their second try in the 33rd, making it 10 to five. And she makes good on that. Trying to take it all the way in, looking for her second try of the half. And instead it's going to be Simone Savory who finishes it off for Ottawa. And just as they did after the first try by St. FX Andrea, Ottawa comes right back and able to bring it back to just a two point game. Nice move by Gray to get it close. And then Savory finishes it off right at the try line. Could possibly give her team a three point advantage heading into halftime. And she is good. Good reach there by Sam Lake, was successful in scoring a try earlier. And I think that's going to be Alfonso who gets it in. AUS Player of the Year, Joanne Alfonso, picks up her fourth try in three games here in Victoria, extending St. FX lead. Ellis pushing it forward. Now Savory again. Ottawa getting near this try line. Hard push here by the GGs. And there it is, a huge answer right away by Ottawa, bringing this game back to three points. They can make it one on the conversion. And Andrea, what can you say about these GGs? It can feel like a lot of pressure, just gaining territory and moving the ball out of the 22 meter. Can breathe, hold back into this team. X has been doing a great job of keeping the pressure on them. Here is what they are known for. And it's gonna be converted. It's McDade who's able to convert that. So it's an eight point game. So now Ottawa is in a lot of trouble with just five minutes or so left to go. As they boot it out of play. And that is it. And that will end this game. A fantastic championship, but it's going to be the ex-women of St. FX coming away with the 2016 championship here in Victoria. Congratulations to St. Francis Xavier.